Dashlane tutorial for beginners how to use Dashlane. So before we proceed specially for beginners, we need to first understand what Dashlane is. Dashlane is one of the best software to use to secure your online account, passwords, and other sensitive information in one place. From this software, you can also easily share your credentials to your team without giving them the actual password for security of your own account. This app is perfect for personal use, family use, and business use. So to start with, first visit dashlane.com and this is the main homepage. This app also has a free plan for new users to explore the software, but it only includes very limited features like 50 passwords, security alert, password health to check how strong are your passwords, password generator, one device and also you can share for up to five accounts if you want more features you can easily upgrade your plan to paid plan the premium for three dollars and 99 cents and these are the features that are included and also they have family plan for five dollars and 99 cents they also have a different plan for a business but let's not tackle about that so for today's tutorial we will create a free account so there are three easy steps that you need to do for you to make use of this software first is to add the extension in your browser so just click on get to install the dash lane app in your browser extension and it may take some time and once your dash lane has been successfully installed in your browser, then you can see the icon here for this app. And to continue, the next step is to create an account. First, provide your email, then create your master password. This master password is the most important password to re remember and don't share it to anyone. And to your other online account password, it's okay if you will forget them. Because once you added your online account passwords here in this Dashlane app, then this app will take care of your password and will always remember your password for you. So make sure that you will create a strong and easy to remember for you password as your master password. So once you are done, click on create my account. Then you'll be redirected to your dashboard and here to get started, we need to follow this guide. So we created an account already. The next step is to add a password. So here we have browser. Let me select Netflix, but it depends on you guys. And it will open a new tab for the Netflix. And here just log in your credential. And after you log in, Dashlane will pop up to help you save your username and password from this app or social media. So just click on save for this one to be saved in your Dashlane vault. Then going back to home dashboard, the next step is to try the autofill. So let's click on it and here you can store personal information saved in your Dashlane vault. For example, here your personal information like your name, your date of birth, and phone number. Just fill out this form and hit continue. And here Dashlane will pop up again to remind you that you can save this information in your vault. So let me just hit save. And once your information saved, the next time that you surf the internet and they ask you for your personal information, you can simply click the field and Dashlane will pop up to autofill the information. With this, there's no need for you to manually enter your information every time you ask, which I feel more convenient to do. Then the next step is to download the mobile app of Dashlane. So to do that, simply click here and scan the QR code from your mobile phone to download the app so that you can easily access your password and personal information anywhere and anytime. So now let's check the left side tab. So here under password is where you can check and add all your passwords for all your online accounts. And you can also share your credential here. Just click share and provide the email for the invitation and select the credentials that you want to share. Then the next tab is the secure notes. So if you have confidential information or documents, you can add it here. You can enter the details here. For example, your ATM card 
pin code, your bad luck code, something like that. And also you can attach some important files here. And the next is your personal information, like what we did earlier. You can also add your address here, like your home address, a shipping address, and business address, so that when you visit a site or purchase online, you can use your dash lane to autofill the information for a faster transaction. And also payments is where you can save your payment method information like debit or credit card information and also bank information so that you can easily process any payment online. So just provide your bank or card information here. And you may also able to save your IDs here like your driver license, social security number, passport, and tax number. Sharing center to share some information. And here you also have your password health. So what you can do here is that you can check how many passwords you saved. And also this app will analyze all your password to show you if you have weak password, reused and compromised password. And if you do, you can right away change your password here to avoid being hacked. Dark web monitoring. So this dash lane tool can scan the dark web for a leak or stolen personal information. So you can take action to protect your data right away. But this feature only available to premium plan, but for new users, you have free trial for 30 days. So this feature has 24 seven surveillance. They will monitor up to five of your email address to check if your password, IDs, or financial information are involved in breach. Then if you have, you'll be receiving instant alerts and expert advice to protect your digital information, like changing your compromised passwords. And also you have for your VPN, but this is only available to premium plan. And by the way, guys, if you want to get a free premium for six months, then you can do what you can do is just go to your password and go to my account and select settings. Here you can refer a friend and for every person who signs up using your referral link, you'll both get six months of free Dashlane premium. And also you can add to factory authentication here to add layer of security in your account. So just go here in your security settings under your my account. And here you can also just import some of your password information if you use other password manager before. So you can import just CSV files. And also you can export your information saved here as well. So just click export. And to check the device you allow the access, you can check it here under Manage Logins. From here, you can also revoke the access of other devices. Just click on the X icon button. So I guess that's all for today's tutorial. And if you have any question, guys, just comment down below. And thank you so much for watching.